Okay, if the rumor is absolutely true, then of course you're talking about um, a very seasoned, well campaign, one of the best organizers politically in the Caribbean as it relates to the general elections by election. This person uh, is a person that who, of course, uh, would have worked with all of the major governments in the region uh, as far as the electoral process is concerned. Um, her affiliation, of course, with the Barbados Labour Party, because since I, I was um, a, a, a candidate on three occasions for the Barbados Labour Party, and I could speak of her in that and tolerance in terms of organization and organizing a political campaign. She's absolutely astute. She's absolutely meticulous. And she is one person that is absolutely reliable. So those three major components in, um, are in play uh, during uh, any election, whether it's by election or general election, she is a formidable um, opponent and a formidable um, person in place that could, uh, could very well be the catalyst to determine the fortunes of any, the fluctuating fortunes of any political party. Of course, if the rumors are true, because up to date uh, we haven't been hearing anything clearly from the Democratic Labour Party, uh, but the fact is, is that it would have been a tremendous coup that they would have achieved, probably would have, um, they would have um, um, uh, made Verda look absolutely good. Uh, it would boost the Democratic Labour Party's chances in terms of presenting a formidable um, program and very organized um, political, political um, platform during this election. <laughs>